the tire. She's like, she's like, smell my mattress, and I, I, I pull the covers back, and I smell it. And there's like this big ass white stain on it. Oh, and I'm come like, on. I'm like, come it, on. I'm, I'm like, I'm like, what is that? And she literally goes, <gasps> like, like she almost like literally, like it wasn't like a fake. It was like I'm about to throw up, and I'm, oh. I'm sitting there like just about to piss my pants laughing. Oh. So, anyways, like. So she's stuck with this thing. Now, when we come out back, because we're about to tear it apart and like wash the, sh the sheet part of it and stuff, restuff it. And there's this other one back here that we use for the massage table. And uh, she's like, "Well, I'm just gonna take this one and I'll put this one back out here." And I'm like, "Yeah, just do that." And I was like, "This one doesn't smell bad, and it's like, you know, it's barely been used or whatever." And she's like, "Okay, well, I'll just do that." And I'm like, "Yeah, just do that." So we do that, and then he comes up to us later, and he's like. Hey, I noticed you. You put that, that mattress back there. Is there a problem with our with our deal that we had? She's like, no, I just this one's better and fits me better. And it's you know and that one kind of smelled weird. And he's like, well, would you have a problem if I tried to trade that one off to Chris and Bree for their cotton? And she's like, no, I'll do you know go ahead, do what you want to do with it. And then he's like, well, he's like technically it's. Could you ask them if they if they would be willing to trade? And I'm like, fuck. On her to get the cotton for you, it's like this man manipulative mm -hmm. thing going on. It's a lot of situations yeah. too, like making mountains out of molehills. You're like, really? Are we really talking about cotton? That's what I'm right now? That's here. Mm -hmm. Like, mm -hmm. like oh, I'll sleep with my cotton. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but it's like stuff like that's rough. It's like this dude's. He's got something in the works, you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, people call us shit. People say, we're trying to do some shit, but it's like, no one sees this dude, you know what I mean? Like, the worst thing that we do is, like, gossip on occasion. Whatever, yeah. we're human beings, you know what I'm saying? We're, we don't sit here and plot against people. We're not like, yo, let's take this one down. Like, yeah. Well, you know? That's what it's trying to look like. Yeah. So I use such horrible shit. people, like, like, trying to get some of what It's like, oh, yeah, do you live with them? <laughs> yeah. You don't know what we know. You haven't seen you what we've you don't know seen. This, you don't know this life. Yeah, would you be... No, you keep walking. You don't know this You're life. You're stuck <laughs> living with that person. <laughs> and it's, the thing is, too, is like people don't understand... I'm not, or you're not, we're not putting ourselves up on a pedestal. I'm sure I can get annoying. I'm sure I can be me, like... I'm, I'm sure I can be weird. I'm sure I can be annoying. weird. An yeah. intelligent person, I'm sure asshole at times yeah these are all things that happen but i moderate them right yeah, exactly like when, I, yeah, when i like when i know i'm having a bad day like say i'm feeling like mean i'm feeling cranky i will take myself away from everybody i'll go sit in the bushes i'll go and sit in the tree me alone? yeah i won't be i won't try and start stuff with people because nah. i'll be like yo i'm in a bad mood i need to get away from people you know <laughs> you look like a dork <laughs> It was funny when you were like, you were like getting really like fired up about something when you did that and you like moved your neck, but your neck's like in that little hole. You were like, <laughs> yo, yeah, I think we, I think we're here for a minute. Cause you think Which I'm cool with, but yeah, I, cause like, it's still just hard not talking to my parents. It's like, yeah. I go through moments I where it's like, I can't wait to give my mom and dad a hug. My parents, my dog, like, my dog busts me up sometimes. But then, I, but then I, I'm okay because I keep telling myself, like, he's being well taken care of. I'm sure he's... And you're going to see him. You know what I mean? And he's, yeah, and like I said, he's and only... realistically, like, think how fast this month already went by. Like, think about, like, when Rob's wedding was, like, not even that long ago. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. But think about, like, dude, this month's almost over. Or on the, tomorrow will be the 19th. Yeah. And then, like, think about, like, how busy next weekend will be because of the Halloween thing. We won't even realize, like, they were, like today went slow because we had nothing to do. Well, and that. once the once November hits and it starts becoming the holiday season, I told Mike that. I was like, the holidays are going to fly by here. Like, oh, yeah. fly by. Because we'll have a lot of, we'll do more stuff for the holidays. We'll be focused on the holidays. The part that's going to suck is January and February when we're like, yo, we miss the holidays with our family. Yeah. Like not for, not for me, anyway. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not real worried about that. Like, Thanksgiving will be tough. I yeah. love Thanksgiving because, like, we always go to, like, my my sisters or my mom and dad's. That'll be tough. But, you know, you got to think about it in the good way, too. They're going to be watching us. Well, that's what I tell. I think I told Mike that one day. I was like, 
You get upset because you assume that everyone's moved on without you. And the fact of the matter is, is you're probably the focal point of almost every conversation that your family and friends are having back yeah. home. They're not like, oh, you know, where'd Taylor go? Oh, he, he just on that one show, like, whatever, moving on. Like, they're probably like, probably your whole you neighborhood's talking. Like? Yeah, probably your whole neighborhood's talking about you. Probably your whole family, extended family, extended, extended family. Like, and it's not like being talked about. It's just the point is, is like, no, people aren't forgetting you. Yeah. Like, if anything, like, I remember Bella writing her letter, like, the, her whole block has like viewing parties every like Friday or something yeah. like that. You know, like people aren't forgetting about you. If anything, yeah. you're more the focal point than you were when you were back there. Exactly. You know, but it's not like that's why we're here. That's no, 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 no. no. About, it's just but... it's more about like not even being the center of attention. It's just like to remind yourself that, like people aren't forgetting about you. Yeah. You know, yeah. your family and your friends like they're still like you know supporting you and what you're doing here, and you know, they see how hard it is. But like. That's the beauty of it is like those are the people, you know, they might see the, you know, how we're like, you know, say we're being portrayed the way my, my, my bros at home will know that's not me. They'll know that something like these are the people that know me through, thick, mm -hmm. you know, through mm -hmm. thick and thin. I, I, you know, as transparent as I can possibly be, these are the people that know me for it. Mm -hmm. And, like, they'll be the ones, like, you know, like that, like, if that, if that little episode of me and Bella got on there, like, when the table right. was just like, like, my dude, yeah. like, you know, I mean, whatever, but, like, I'm not going to be talked down to by some older woman just because. Or anybody, or anybody. Yeah. It has nothing to do with her being a woman. No. It's anybody. Yeah, you're exactly right. It you has know? nothing to do with her being a woman. It's just, I'm not going to be talked down to. And I'm sure, and they, I don't want to talk down to her, but it's like, talk to me as a human being. Show me some respect. You'll get the same in return. Mm -hmm. But until you, until you do that, I can be as just as loud and I'm just mm -hmm. as obnoxious as you can. My best friend, Jay. He's like, sometimes, and like, it makes me feel better when I know, like, he's probably, station right now mm -hmm. you know and your friends like they know you so well your friends and family are probably like yo i know what she's thinking right now when so and so said that to her like mm -hmm. yo i can see the irritation in her eyes only because i know her that well oh she yeah sure like you know in just moments where it's like i just think it's funny too because it's like sir you, you've had some with me you've had a lot more like intelligent speeches when it comes to like certain things like our group meetings or like the vote off and stuff and then there's certain times where i'm just like Man, I look like a dumbass. <laughs> I just said like three words, and this was like, I just didn't like him. I just didn't. That's what. Yeah. I'm for. <laughs> you know, yeah, like, yeah. Like, there's like, you know, I try my best, but at the same time, well, I mean, you and I, I, I know each other well enough. Like, you and I, and you and Aaron, me and Aaron, and then me and Mike now too have gotten closer. Where, like, when something's going down, I can look at you in your eyes, and we don't even smile. We're like, <laughs> yo, <laughs> I, I just like. Mm. You're irritated, aren't you? <laughs> yeah. Like, and then it's one of those like I don't even need to nod. I don't even need to say anything. You don't even you're, need just to like, you're just like, yep, I know you're irritated. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <That's> like, <laughs> like I'm about to punch her in the jugular. <laughs> she doesn't leave me alone. <laughs> like even you, like I can look at you and you're like, yep, she's about to snap on Bella. Yeah. She's about to snap. I'm just like, yeah. You just look over me and you're like. I'm about to not have a mohawk because I'm about to. Yeah. My entire head. It's a transitional thing. <laughs> but. Yeah, like you. I'll hang out with you after this. I'll hang out with Aaron. I would hang out with Mike probably. I don't know if I would. I wouldn't go like. I, I don't think I would go hang out with Mike alone because I aren't that close. But like. I think Aaron... you'll get to that point though. Yeah. That's Plus true. The, the, the funny thing is you should because you guys live the closest out of everybody here. Well, that's funny too. Like. Is the people I'm closest with here it's so are like actually all dudes? Like I like all the girls here. I don't, but like I definitely I get along better with all the dudes here. Well, that's what I'm saying like the two the two girls I get along best with is you and Hex, mm -hmm. obviously. Mm -hmm. And I get along with pretty much every dude here, mm -hmm. other than Josh. Me and Josh don't really click. You didn't like him from day one, though. I remember you he rubbed you the wrong way from day one when you no, were first I liked here. him from day one. I or like not day after, one, but like, like the, after the first week, I was. like, do you feel like he was like kind of like patronizing you and stuff? Wasn't patronizing. It was like he wasn't giving me a chance. You know what I mean? To like prove myself. It was just like the constant like, you know, oh, you're a landscaper. Like, you know, you can go work in the garden. It's like, dude, you know what work I'm about to do is take this shovel and do work up. 
I love when you come up with stuff like that because I'm not expecting it. You're like, the only word I'm about to do is take this shovel and beat your skull in. <laughs> how, you, how you feel about that? Yeah. And then guess who's going to do all the construction work? I will. You'll be gone. <laughs> about it today. It was like two weeks before I, uh, no, it was like, it was my